Welcome to Cypher, an open source memory layer for your coding agents. Have you ever found yourself switching between coding agents while working on a project, like hitting a rate limit with cursor right in the middle of building a feature? Then you rush to Claude code, only to realize it has no idea about the progress you made in cursor. What if you had a unified memory layer for all your coding agents? Meet Cypher, a one and for all memory layer for agents. Just plug in its MCP server and you're good to go. And it's completely open source. With Cypher, Cursor now remembers everything you've done in past sessions, even across different agents. Same with Claude Code. With Cypher, integrating multiple coding agents in your project has never been easier. You can also handcraft the memories for Cypher by preparing a detailed file for their new features. Serious coders like you and me don't want agents to do everything. We want to set specs, rules for the project, like a PRD. That's where Cypher comes in. It acts as your project's bookkeeper, so whenever you start a new session, your agents can instantly retrieve these specs without wasting time or tokens rereading everything from scratch. Let's get Cypher set up in your project. First, head over to Cypher's official GitHub and clone the repo to your local machine via HTTPS or SSH. Next, Run the setup command to install required packages and build the project. You'll still need to configure a few things. In cipher.iml, define your list of MCP servers. For the LLM, Cypher supports OpenAI, Anthropic, OpenRouter, and more. You'll need to specify the provider, model name, and API key. Finally, you can customize the system prompt for Cypher to act accordingly to your needs. Now, let's move on the MCP config for Cypher. To configure Cypher as an MCP server, run the command with MCP mode. Cypher MCP. You can set the MCP mode to either default or aggregator. Both work, but I'm using aggregator here. Depending on your provider, you'll need to add the appropriate API key. In this example, I'm using OpenAI, so an OpenAI API key is required. For the vector store, Cypher currently supports Milvis and Quadrant. I'll go with Milvis here. There are a few more vector store config variables. Check Cypher's documentation for full details on those. Test out Cypher MCP. Now the Cypher MCP server is up and running, ready to serve as the memory layer for your agents. Let's test it with cursor. I'll use Cypher's search tool to retrieve the project's progress. And boom, it correctly pulls up what's been stored in memory. Now let's ask Claude Code to find where we left off last session. Give it a moment, and there it is. A full summary of everything we've done so far in the project. That's the power of Cypher. View the repo and start now.